Hello everyone. I have some more stamps and dies to show you and some dies that I have gotten in. And so first let me show you um, this let me get my little doohickey thing out here for you. Um, so I ordered um, this stamp set or this die set, stamp set, sorry, not die set, stamp set from um, Simon Says Stamp um, because I had um, gotten the dies that dies in a D-stash, and I was like, um, well, I guess I need the stamps to go with it, so, um, it's the Let's, let's Roll, and, um, super cute, but I had already, I already had the, the stamp set, um, or the die set, so I figured I better get the stamp set so I'd be able to, to actually use it. Now, another thing I got in a D-stash was this here it says in the frame die collection i have tried to find out what um that how that works and what you're supposed to do with that if anyone knows i'd really appreciate some feedback on that um because i i went online to simon says stamp and uh everything and i just i couldn't find out anything couldn't nothing came up okay so from ally express I got this cute little, and they are little, um, animals. And this is what they look like stamped out. And they are tiny. <laughs> but I think they'll be really cute, like to put in, in a... Um, I have one of those uh, peekaboo window things. I think they'll be really cute to put under behind a peekaboo window because um, they're so small. But um, yeah, I was kind of kind of surprised when I saw that one how small they were. Then I got this stamp set and die set. This is this came with the the dies. This is from AliExpress also. And I can't remember what this is called, but I'll leave the links um, in my description. And so this is what it looks like. Cute little um, aliens. I think that's what it's called, too. This alien something or other. But um, I thought those were cute. And then I also got this... Um, stamp set here but um, there were no dies um, available for it so I'm hoping that it w they will um, eventually um, get some because this is a really cute die set I mean cute stamp set and it's at first I thought it was just a, a Christmas but it actually has um, autumn on here it has Valentine's Day um, and the, some of the, um, the, um, things that you can, um, get, um, oh, it's got a couple leaves, it's got a heart, so, but this is the stamp set, and I think it's so cute, look at those little penguins, there we go, see the little penguins, those cute. So I'm hoping I can eventually find the the die set that goes with uh, that one. So um, I, that took two pages to um, stamp out. So these are the two, um, oh, I guess you call them like little elves. And then there's the penguins and my favorite of these are the owls oh my gosh these owls a little boy owl and a little girl owl is that not cute and then they have the um the boy penguin and the girl penguin 
super cute. And um, that one uh, is the one that I don't have a die set for that I'm really hoping I will be able to um, find um, the die set. And here's the, um, the stamps from the um, Simon Says Stamp one that I got. Uh, let's roll. So I got those. And then I have one, two more things to show you. Um, a couple of dies that I got in. Well, actually, there's three. But um, first, I want to show you this one here, this die here. It's a large die. This is a six by six. And so it's a big die. And it cuts, it cuts this here, cuts just like this. I took a piece of six by six um, glitter paper and it cut it just like that. So um, it's really large, but it's very, very pretty. I think it'll look really nice on a card. So there's that die. And then I couldn't remember if I showed you guys this die or not. It's um, not a winter die. It's it's more of a of a spring um, die, and the um, that. This will cut into your paper as long as you take off the ring. But if you put the ring around it, then it'll cut out the the uh, image. And so this is what it looks like. I actually cut it out in a couple different colors. Um, so that's what it looks like. It's a really nice die, actually. I'm kind of pretty happy with it. Now, my next one is, um, I was surprised at how small this was, but I'm very glad it's the size it is. It is, let me measure this for you real quick here um, and tell you how big this is. This one is um, four and a quarter by three. So um, it's a smaller die. Let me show you what it looks like cut out. And this is what it looks like cut out. Now I'm going to show you what takes ever, forever and ever and ever to do is this. I cut it out in red, green. First I cut it out in brown, then I cut it out in red, green, and white, and paper pieced it. And it was a lot of work. <laughs> um, and I've got to find a different way to um, be able to paper piece um, this many pieces. Um, oh, and I cut it out, or cut the beak out in orange. So, you know, everything was cut out in a different color. But I love it. I think it's so pretty. And, and it just, it's so pretty. You know, this, this is okay. But... This is fabulous. Um, you know, taking the time to paper piece can just totally change the image. Um, like I said, this is nice. Um, you could just put a small a rectangle right behind just this here, and um, it might be it might look nice. You know, uh, even black. Even put a piece of black behind it. But I just think this is. I love this. Love it. And it was kind of like putting a puzzle together because, you know, I had all these little pieces and then I had to figure out where they went. And uh, so that was kind of fun, actually. <laughs> but I got to find out a different way to, because what I did was I put tape on the back of these and then I just went and I laid my, turned it over and laid my pieces down and pressed them down really hard. So, um, but then I had to cut all the pieces of uh, tape that were sh still showing and that was probably the worst that was the worst part of the whole process so I'm going to see if I can't come up with something better um, 
in, in, in paper piecing something like this. So anyway, thanks you guys for watching and I hope you have a blessed day. Bye.